Me. You mentioned that the department, Mr. Gates, has got a number of important decisions in the weeks and months ahead. Uh, the Defense Acquisition Board is meeting Monday or scheduled to on the Joint Strike Fighter. Can you give some insight into what they will be reviewing, and will that include this technical baseline review from Admiral Vinlet? Um, the the DAB is indeed, I love these terms, the DAB is meeting Monday, as you said, but I would just underscore to you, Tony, that it, this was a meeting that was scheduled back in June. So there's nothing sort of, there's no development that has necessitated this meeting. Uh, it was put on the books in June. It's scheduled to take place on Monday. It will focus, yes, on the JSF and in sp specifically on the work that Admiral Venlet has been doing with his technical baseline review, which is near completion, not final, but uh, considerable work has, has been done there. Uh, they will review that. They'll discuss some uh, uh, JSF management issues for the coming year. But I would emphasize, Tony, that you should not expect any decisions to come out of this, uh, this meeting on Monday. Um, any decisions with regard to this program, as important as it is, would likely be made, or at least the major decisions, of course, be made by the Secretary himself, and likely as a part of the 2012 budget review. But uh, as you know, uh, Admiral Vinlet had, you know, was brought in uh, as a three-star to and with, with a lot, a lot of experience to really dive deep into this program, deeper than we've ever gone before, um, and uh, find out uh, as much as we can about any remaining challenges that we face with regards to it. Uh, he has done this. I mean, this is soup to nuts. This is 120 people not taking anybody's word for anything, but saying to them, show me the money, show me the proof, show me the data. Uh, don't give me your version of the world. I want to see your version of the world. And uh, I think as a result, we feel as though we have a much better understanding, including some new issues, um, of where we stand with this program and what might need to be done as a result of that. Is it fair to say that it roughly is going to recommend additional cost, additional dollars and additional schedule slip to the development program? I'm not, uh, I'm not going to say what it's fair to say at this point. Uh, this, as I said, it's not done yet, and uh, and it will be any recommendations that come out of it uh, will be dealt with as a part of the budget review, which is something you know the, the particulars of which that we don't discuss publicly. So you just have to hold your horses in that front. I mean, a layperson re watching this program would say to him, him or herself, it "This was program or the JSF program." Yeah. The F-35 program. Yeah. There was a jet estimate last November that resulted in a lot of change to the program. There was a Nun McCurdy breach in Washington parlance in June. Now there's another review of this program, three in a one year. Is this a troubled program that needs all these reviews? I mean, what's going on here? A prudent person would ask. Well, I mean, you've sort of answered the question yourself with, with, with how you've stipulated things. I mean, clearly, if it's a Nun McCurdy breach, it's having trouble, right? Um, okay, but by definition, if we've hit Nam McCurdy, there have been issues with this program. There have been troubles with this program. Uh, we've acknowledged that, for frankly, for the last couple of years. Um, and the secretary, in February, undertook a major restructuring of this program. Uh, and I can go. Th we can talk at length about the measures he took, about the money he withheld, about the people he let go, about the people he hired and promoted. Uh, and then, but one of the key components of this was tasking the new program manager to take a deeper dive than we have ever taken in this before, so as to avoid future surprises about this program. That's what Admiral Vinlet has been doing. That's what he has nearly completed. Uh, and uh, as I said la uh, last time I saw you and, and just a few moments ago, he has discovered additional issues that are of concern. We are, uh, it is not, those issues may be discussed in the DAB, um, but there will be no actions taken at the DAB as a result of those. That, those kinds of actions would be reserved for the 2012 uh, budget process. You can't give a sense of some of these issues, whether they're cost or technical related? Oh, I mean, Tony, it's, I mean, just to give you one example, um, we had a belief at one point that we had 
X number of lines of code left to be written. Code. Yes. And what we found is we have more software code to be written than we had originally thought. Um, so that's just an example of having, you know, gone under the hood yourself and taken a look at the engine uh, firsthand that we have discovered additional things that need to be done uh, to get ultimately to where we want to be. You're 10 years into this program now and you're telling me this year is when you're taking the deepest dive ever. Uh, you wonder why this wasn't done before, the deepest dive. Well, Tony, obviously there have been reviews of this program previously. Yeah. Uh, I think at the time, and frankly, I would, I would, I, I think it's fair to say the secretary is frustrated by the fact that they have not been as, uh, they have not fully illuminated the issues of this program. Um, and he made it clear when he took, undertook the restructuring in February, when he, when he hired Admiral Vinlet, that he did not want future surprises. So let's get to a baseline now. Let's figure out where bottom is. Uh, and then come to me so we can make decisions fully informed by all the problems that we, we face. Um, but let me just also make clear, and I know this bores some in our, some in our audience, but I know it's of, of great interest to you, Tony. Let me also, and you're absolutely right, and that's why I want to underscore this point. Don't mistake any of this as any sort of wavering on, uh, on this program. This program is... Uh, th this will be the backbone of our TAC Air uh, for decades to come. Um, so it is of vital importance to this department. The secretary has believed that for some time. He continues to believe that. Uh, and, you know, we fully expected that there would be development issues in a program as sophisticated as this one. Uh, frankly, every time we've met them, we've overcome them. Uh, but we want to have a full, as full an appreciation as possible up front for what more still needs to be done so that we can plan accordingly. And that's what we're in the midst of right now. Um, yes, Justin. 